have you read the Quran? Quran? A true book. Hold on. What is Quran? Ah, well then. What is, what is Quran? If you have to ask that question, yeah. you have to go away and study. What is Quran? Oh, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Do you mind? Mm -hmm. Sorry. No, no, um, come on. Sorry. I read the Quran and I'm very disturbed by the teachings of the Quran. Would you like to would you like to discuss the teachings of the Quran? Don't worry. Listen to her. We love her. If, you have, if you have been disturbed by the Quran, that means you haven't read it properly. And that means she that speaks Arabic. Well, 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 I don't worry about the language, you hear so, the word of God. Since am I right to understand that you are Muslim? Okay. Are you? Yeah. Okay. So you are Muslim. You should be saying Alhamdulillah, I am Muslim. But anyway, that's not I my business. Tell, well, well, so are you a Muslim? I'm Christian. Okay, Thanks well, to Lord tell, Jesus well, Christ, I am Christian. Well, so talk to me about what you know. So don't tell me what about I. So I so I read the Quran and I'm disturbed by the teachings of the Quran. Like I want what? to bring a couple of them. Mm -hmm. And do you mind explaining to me? and correct my misinterpretations or misunderstanding. Is that all right? Yeah. What's your name? Farouk. Farouk. My name is Hatun. Nice to meet you. He is the king of Egypt, King Farouk. Okay. So, I'm, I'm just going to start with a couple of, there are lots of, but first one is, as a woman, I am very concerned teachings of Islam when it comes to the woman. I have been with many Muslim men, and then who wanted me to become a Muslim? As I read the Quran, I only not concern for myself as a Christian, but I also concern for Muslim woman. Okay? So I am asking in that context. So I'll just read the verse okay, to you. Fine, okay. And I want oh, you to wait, explain okay. the verse wait, 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 to me. In what you've just said, there's a whole bring up something. Well, no, don't worry, leave them, let me hear the word of God. I want to hear his talk over there. No, yeah, yeah, don't worry. Don't, don't stop there. He's telling you something very important. Yes. Yes. She's talking to me. No, no both of you. I, I desire to hear his No, don't run away. You can't do a lot of different questions. Tim, don't go, don't go in the I'll actually ask Sorry, can you speak a little bit louder? No, I can't. I've got a sore throat. Yes. I'll come to next yes. to you. Do you mind? Yes. Uh, he's coming back. Yeah, All right, let me uh, Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, we are listening. Sorry, yeah. can you repeat what you said? Yeah, uh, let me make you understand something because I mean, I'm not into this Muslim Christian dialogue thing because. It, 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 a lot of Muslims tend to think that they are scholars. A lot of Christians tend to think that they are scholars, and none of them are. Okay, you're not a scholar, I'm not a scholar. So let's talk on a, what's it called, a um, lay person's level? Lay person? That's right, we are here, yeah, that's right. So, okay, yeah. right. so don't expect me to have all the answers to yeah. you, just as that you don't have all, my, yeah. all the answers so to let me, let me just yeah, yeah. Let okay. me just unpack something. My my scripture. I am Christian. Sir, are you Christian? I am. Sir, are you? Yeah, what are, are you? Are I, Christian? I was brought up as okay. a Catholic. So okay. I understand Christianity. Okay. Let let me let me just unpack something. I am Christian, and my scripture doesn't tell me for me to understand who God is, for me to understand what God has done for me. And able to explain the good news of Lord Jesus Christ right. to people, I need to be scholar. Oh, well, My scripture, scripture, Bible doesn't tell me that. Doesn't okay? Not. So, as I, as you say, you ask this gentleman if you read the Quran. I stepped in, and then I'm going to bring my concern on the Quran. If you, if you don't, if you don't know how to answer it, that's absolutely fine, okay? Because I know you are not God. I am not God. I don't have answer to everything. You don't have answer to everything. But still, I want to express my concerns, and I want you to help me to understand what is happening. Okay? So. Surah 2, 223 is my first verse. I'm going to bring it to you, okay? Your wives are a place of cultivation, sowing of seed for you. So come to your place of cultivation, however you wish, and put forth for yourself. And fear Allah and know that you will meet him and give him good tidings to the believers. So. My understanding from this verse is, you can, sorry for the language, no, you worry. can enter your wife however you want. In marriage, if I cannot tell my husband, my lovely husband, I don't want to have a sex with you, according to this teaching, 
I don't have that right. My husband can have sex with me, with me however, whenever you want. That's how you this understand is, it. This is one of my concerns. Okay, so, okay. Yeah, can you just tell me what is this, what's okay. happening? That you understood it wrong. Okay, help me to understand. Have you heard that part of saying so, Quran before? So, Have you heard that yeah, before? I get it. So, Rebecca, yeah, what he, she said, is it true? No, he said I am wrong. Yes. So, I want I'm him to. Yeah. I understood wrong. The context yeah. in that she is understanding yeah. is wrong. But you hear this word before. What is saying? Yeah. So, saying it? I'm yeah. telling you, I've heard it. Okay, okay. So, right. if my understanding so, is wrong. Words, let, me, let, me, let me help you to understand. Men can can you talk? Uh, when you talk to me, can you look at me? Well, it's helpful it. for me because you you got so. I'm fine. I'm having a good time. I'm fine. They're, they're, they're mis they have a little bit of misunderstanding of their so no, 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 no. So I'm giving you the opportunity to correct me. Uh, so okay. Yeah, give me the men and women. God created men and women, right? To do what? To come together, have children. Yeah. That's what it tells you. So when we talk about men come to women, or men come to their wives, right? In any which way, they, in any way they want. That doesn't mean to say they come there and abuse them and say that. When I say you must obey, that's that's not what it means. It, it's trying to make you understand that men and women, men and women, when they are married, can come together and have. Because relations. So that's what it means. That's all it means. It doesn't okay. mean anything else. So, you are telling me, actually divorce means men and woman, as a husband and wife, they are responsible to one another is one of our responsibility to my husband or his responsibility to me is sex. One of so that's one of them. So, theologically, I agree with you only on that part, but I disagree. This is what the verse is saying. So I'm just gonna read the background of the verse, okay? And I want you to put this background and reconcile this background with what you just told me, okay? It comes from the hadith. A hadith. Hadith. Okay. So I'm going to. I'm going. To, I know hadith is not Quran, but. But for you to understand what is the background of this verse, you need to go to hadith. Is that not correct? If the hadith is sahih. So, I'm just going to read the hadith to you, and I want you to reconcile this hadith for me. Quranic verse, so come to your tilt, however you will, may Allah forgive him. The fact is that this claim of Ansa, who were adultery, adult, adulteries, lived in the company of the Jew, Jews, who were, who were the people of the book. They, the Ansa, ex accept their superiority over themselves in respect of knowledge, and they follow most of their actions. People of the book used to have intercourse, sexual relationships with their woman on one side alone. Yes, yes, I okay? I don't understand what you just read. People of the book used to have sex with their wives, their woman, on one side alone. Who are the people of the book? Jewish in this context, sir. Jews, Christians, and Muslims. In this context, it's talking about the Jews. No, no, no. Because people it's of the book, from the point of view of the Quran, are Jews. In Christians, the Quran, people of the books are Jews and Christians. Oh, uh, you but are you a Muslim? No. Sir, okay, well, I am a Muslim. I'm telling you, when it calls. Oh, you're not listening. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, let, let me tell you something. I'm not here to argue. No, 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 no. Sir, if you are not here to argue, can you just answer, engage and I'm with me? I'm not here to appease you. I, 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 I'm not, listen, I'm not listen, asking listen, you to please me. Listen, you I'm must talking, please yes, your sir, God. Listen, listen. So I am asking you. My, 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 my lady, I don't know what, what you My name is Hatun. So I'm let, me, let me ask you something. Me and you was having a conversation. You was asking me some questions. Okay. This lady has now come and try to interact. No, no, I can't it's say not, it's, not, it's got nothing to do with that. Here, we are in High Park Corner, we can say whatever we Yes, but I was sitting, standing here, and she just came, I didn't ask for it today. But I'm I said to her, I said, you know, what, like it doesn't matter what you say, okay. right? Because what you say ain't going to change my belief. Ma'am, I, I am sorry that you have to go through this kind of treatments at Speakers yes. Corner, oh, where we all come to practice our freedom of speech. What did you say? What did you say? Say it again. 
What you have to go to this kind of treatment at Speaker's Corner. Sorry about that. No, no, no. I'm sorry that people are talking to you in this way. Sorry about that. Just ignore that. So don't get offended. They are just. So, sir, are you able to engage with me with regarding my question? Well, well, you've read something out there and I didn't understand a word okay. you read. So I'm going to read it again. Yeah. Anyone who is English, are you English, sir? You look English. Yeah. So, he is English, okay? I'm sorry that you are not understanding my English. I'm going to ask this gentleman, what's your name? Alex. I'm going to ask him to read it for us, okay? Sir, can you kindly read this for us? This whole paragraph? Yeah, if you come next to me so we yeah, can yeah. make sure. Sorry, man. And before you start reading it, Alex, is it you know Alex? Alex. Yeah, he's got before Alex. you start reading it, whether whether it's understood or not, what are you expecting to get from it? So, I ask you the question, why Quran is encouraging husband to, husband to force themselves uh, into their wives, yeah, no, however no, and whatever you no, want, no, they no, want. No, but, and then you say that's, that's not correct. This, this now, not correct. I am going that's to, false. yeah. So you told me that's not correct. Now I'm going to give you the background of the, that, that verse. And I want you to look at the background and then tell me what is happening in this background. So this gentleman, thanks for willing to read it for us. He's going to read it in English since my English is not good enough. Yeah. Okay. So, I've been a misunderstood the Quranic verse. It says, so come to your tilt, however, you will. May Allah forgive him. The fact is that this clan of the Ansar who were idolaters lived in the company of the Jews who were the people of the book. They, the Ansar, accepted their superiority over themselves in respect of knowledge and they followed most of their actions. The people of the book, i.e. the Jews, used to have intercourse with their women on one side alone, by lying on their backs. This was the most concealing for the um, Virginia, Virginia of women. This clan of the answer adopted this practice from them. But this tribe of the um, Quraysh used to uncover the women intensely and seek pleasure with them from in front and behind and laying them on their backs. When the Muhajirun Muhajirun yeah, and the immigrants came to Medina, a man married a woman of um, the answer. He began to do the same kind of action with her, but she disliked him and said to him, we were approached on one side by a lion on the back. Do it so otherwise, keep away from me. This matter of theirs spread widely, and it reached the Apostle of Allah. So Allah, the Exalted, sent down the Quranic verse. Your wives are tilt to you, so calm to your tilt, however you will, i.e. From, from in front, from behind, or lying on the back. Okay, so this, the back. thank you. Do you so, understand what you just read? So I'm just going to summarize. Sir, do you understand? So, just a moment. Farouk? Do you understand what you just read? Sir, so, so, just, just a moment, sorry. Sorry? His job, sorry, I didn't ask Alex to read it, understand it, and explain to us. I can't understand? ask him, I can't ask him to read it as in English, yes. okay? So, now I'm going to summarize what I understood, and I want you to correct me if my understanding is wrong. I'll try. Okay? So, those, you are all English, so you now you can help me if I'm struggling with English. Since go his, ahead, yeah, since, his ahead. since his, yeah, go ahead. did you give my Quran back? Yeah, that's Sorry. So, there is group of women, Jewish women, they have sex in a certain way. When they move to Medina, now Muslims are engaging with other people group, this Muslim man wants to have sex in different way, okay? But woman says, no, we used to have sex only one way, I don't want you to have sex with me in different way, what is different okay? Way? So, women used to have sex on lying on their backs, okay? Now, 
this man wants to have sex in a different way. I'm sorry for the language, but that's what the Hadith says. What the different way is. I'm not gonna give you the sex education here. Yeah? So I'm not perished yet, but this woman is being very abusive. She's trying to trap me into agreeing to say that. That's why I went away. I mean, so she's a, so she, so she, she's expecting me to have the answer to her question. She's not. But the questions so, so are already. So can I finish? The can I finish? Erroneous. No, you can't. Why not? Because, why don't you even want me to explain it to you, you so you can correct me? No, because you, so you can correct me. No, Let me finish my sentence and you correct no, me. No, I can't correct you because the, because what you've read doesn't make no sense to me. Okay, so I am sorry that okay. Islamic hadith doesn't make sense to Muslims. Yeah, this, That's this, another reason uh, I will never become a Muslim because matter. even you your hadith not, doesn't not make sense. Reality. You even a Muslim, your not hadith reality. doesn't this hadith, make sense. This hadith is erroneous and it doesn't really make sense to me. Okay, because it, I am sorry because, it wait, doesn't make sense to you. you. Keep saying you're sorry. But, but explain let me, let, to me. No, I can't ex explain because I don't understand the question. Okay, so because, since me, you don't me, understand me, this let topic, let me, let's move to let, the next topic no, no, then. No, we're not. Let's finish with this. Because you don't are talk to me like that. a lot of different um, questions, right? And you're kind of moving from one situation to another. You've already mentioned about, the, um, and I'm not apologizing about it, you're talking about how people have sex. You're talking about the Jews used to have sex in one way, then they went to Medina and had sex in another way. You haven't clarified that. What do you mean, have sex? in a different way. What's the problem with a man and a woman who are married having sex? What's the problem with that? Are you married, sir? Yes, I am. Okay. So, um, please, please go home and then talk to your wife how many different ways people can have sex with one another. Okay? Many, many so, you need to, yeah, many different ways. In this occasion, one this time. woman, let me finish. In this occasion, this woman used to have sex only one way alone. Okay, that was she was lying on her backs. That yeah. was that was this, that who was is this woman? that was woman from Ansar. And uh, who's the Ansar? Do you know what Ansar is? Can I finish? No, no, no. I want to Sir, the question. Don't as talk you to me like that. Um, don't talk to me like that. I am I am seriously trying to express my concern on the woman, on the position of woman and you are just running away. So let me just since he ran away, let me just explain what's happening. While woman, while woman used to have sex only one way, now as Muslim wants to have sex with her in lots of different ways. She doesn't want it. Allah steps in and sends the revelation. You can enter your wife however you want. They are tilt for you. Your wives are a tilt to you. So come to your tilt however you will. In the context, she just doesn't want to have sex with the man the way he wants. So Allah is simply saying he can force himself into you however he wants. 2018 language that's called rape. That's all I am asking. That's all one of my concerns, but non-Muslims don't want to engage with them. It is said that Quran doesn't make sense. Islamic Dawah team doesn't understand the Quran itself.